Hey guys, T2 out here. Welcome to the Titan Preparedness Channel. Today we're going to be showing you how you can get over 160 gallons of clean, pure drinking water every single day just using the Hydro Blue VersaFlow. Before we start this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button, ring that bell to get notified. If you've watched my channel recently, you have seen that I have fallen in love with this Hydro Blue VersaFlow. It is a 0.1 micron hollow fiber membrane water filter, just like the Sawyer Mini right at the same price as the Sawyer Mini, but it can do so much better things. For one, it can be used as a gravity system, which we'll demonstrate later. You can also use in the five gallon bucket adapter situation, which we are doing today. PD, this was really for you because of you. Yeah. You and your wife don't store a lot of water. No, we normally keep about maybe one two liter bottle in the refrigerator, but we don't really worry about it because we live right across from the lake. Right. So I mean, it's just a simple walk across the road, down the hill, and we have water. I'd be going down to the lake with two liter bottles or a five gallon bucket, whatever I got, bring it up to the house, running it through a shirt, and then running it through a Sawyer Mini to get that clean water. A lot of squeezing, a lot of walking back and forth. Yeah. So recently we gave away the Hydro Blue VersaFlow and at the $20 configuration, it comes just with the VersaFlow. You can put two liter bottles on here you can put the knock water bags on here you can gravity flow it's still a very useful system as is in this configuration if you spend the extra five bucks and you get the VersaFlow kit it comes with a whole lot more so of course it comes with a hydro blue VersaFlow it also comes with two 64 ounce water bags which like I said can be used as a gravity fed system you would put dirty water in this bag you would empty this bag of all the air this is the gray side, this is the clean side, and it comes with little carabiners that you can... Throw on the ground. Throw on the ground. It comes with little carabiners that you can hang from a tree. In this gravity-fed configuration, you get the half gallon of water in 16 minutes and 45 seconds. The idea behind it is that you can hang this from a tree, go set up camp, go do whatever, and then you come back and you have a half gallon of water Purified. Good, Purified. Drink, good drinking water. Yeah. The kit also includes a hose and a little hose clamp and then the bucket adapter. What we're going to be showing you today is how to use the Hydro Blue and create a five gallon bucket system. All right. So this system is very easy to use. Hose, hose clamp, then the Hydro Blue. The gray water goes right here. Take a five gallon bucket or whatever size bucket you want. We drilled a five eighths inch hole three fingers high. What that's going to do, PD, if you fill this bucket up at night, a lot of the heavy sediment is going to settle to the bottom. And then in the morning time, when you run it, it's going to prevent that heavy sediment from, from going through your filter. So it's going to be a lot easier on your filter. You're going to have back flush less. Now we could have put this hole right here on the bottom, but if we put it on the bottom, all the dirt, all the debris, all the sediment, has to run through this hydro glue. It can do it, but it's just really gonna kill the life of the filter. So this bucket adapter already has a little screen on it. It's also gonna block a bunch of like debris from getting in here anyway. Just take this bucket adapter, separate it, put one O-ring on the outside of your bucket, put one O-ring on the inside of your bucket, and then they just screw together. You take your hose, make sure you're on the gray side, the dirty side of your hydro blue. Right now we have the valve shut. So we're going to connect our hose, we're going to pre-filter our water, open up the clamp, and water is going to flow out of here. Clamp's really easy to use, push up, it opens, we're going to leave it closed for right now. We are going to pre-filter our water just using a rag, just a towel, so I'll hold it if you want to flow it. Don't get me wet, it's cold. I'm going to try not to. So this isn't going to get everything. Obviously, this is just a kitchen towel. You can use a t-shirt, you can use whatever, but it's at least gonna get a lot of the big particles out. That's going to help out the filter. Get a little bit of the dirt out. So you can kind of see here, we got one glass filled with just the dirty water. And then that glass is after the, just running it through the rag. Not very much, but I mean, this ain't a, this ain't a review on a, dish right. towel neither yeah. like you said super simple all you gotta do is unclamp it it's flowing this was the lake water and this is the lake water after going through the hydro blue so nice and clean and clear 
So the Hydro Blue removes Crypto, Spiridium, E. coli, Giardia, filters down to 0.1 microns. And so this water is clean enough to drink. We know there's no viruses in this lake, at least not for now. Yeah. Come grid down, there might be a little something different. So now you've got clean filtered water, good enough for drinking. Doesn't smell funny. Still has a little lakey taste. I'm not even gonna consume that one. Yeah, no, definitely. It's rained for the last like week. So this is actually a lot cleaner than I expected the water to be, just pulling it out. If you look at the lake right now, it is nothing but mud. We just had so much runoff coming off from all the floods and all. I mean, you don't even know what's in this lake now. Definitely be a good idea if you're drinking from the lake, run it through a filter. If we were setting this up more longer term, like I said, it did taste a little lakey. I would take this empty bucket and I would put it on top and I would layer it charcoal sand, charcoal sand, and then run the water through it down into this bucket, then through the hydro blue. That would get a lot of that lake taste out. It would also remove a lot of the larger particles that activated carbon or the charcoal is really going to help clean up your water. So the tops connect to all your standard 28 millimeter threads. So if he held it down, it's going to filter into this bucket and now he can pass out clean drinking water. All right guys, so we got one gallon in eight minutes and 30 seconds. Not bad, all you got to do is set this bucket up, let it flow. So bear with me, if, I'm, if my math is wrong, let me know. It's going to take us 42 and a half minutes to get through an entire five gallon bucket. That comes out to 169 gallons a day flowing through this filter. And that's doing it 24 seven nonstop. Now 169 gallons, you have five people in your household. You, you don't need 169 no, gallons. No, no. But the good thing about it is a simple filter system like this, everyone's got access to the water, but most people don't want to drink this dirty, nasty water. They want to drink clean filtered water. So 169 gallons a day, that is clean filtered water for your family of five and then Plus. half of this community. Yeah. That's a tradable good. You can say, hey, I've got the filter. I'm not doing the work. Though. You can make them come down here to the lake, get the water, bring it to you, and you take a gallon of it. Now you don't have to do any of the work. Or you can trade for canned goods or power or whatever. Let's say the grid went down. You had this system. You set it up. You had 169 people every single day that came to you for one gallon of drinking water. This filter system with back flushing and all that stuff, because it's rated at 100,000 gallons, is going to last you for 1.6 years at 169 gallons a day. That's a lot of water. Yeah. Now, if it's just you and your family, family of five, five gallons per drinking water a day, it's still going to last you for 20,000 days, which is 54 years. Yeah. Say. To back flush the system is super easy. You put clean water in here, put it on the clean side. You would squeeze your clean water and it would back flush the system. This system does have a little window right here that kind of shows you where, how dirty it is. Of course, with these hydro blues, the solumenes, the life straws, all of that, you don't want to freeze them. And once you're done with them, shake them out, blow them out, let them dry for a couple of days, and then they're good to be put up. That is how you can get almost 170 gallons of clean drinking water out of one little, what was it, $25 investment. Yeah, $25 investment, three bucks for the bucket. So this is great for people who are living on the lake or if you got a pond, you got a stream, you got a body of water near you. If you live inside the city and you don't get, you don't have a lot of water to begin with, a system like this is still gonna help you, but if you don't have a large body of water, it might not help you as much. Yeah, guys, we uh, hope you enjoyed this review of the Hydro Blue and the five gallon bucket adapter. Definitely go check them out and uh, let us know what you think. Yeah. Let us know what filter you use and how you would filter out massive amounts of water every single day if you had to. Like, comment, subscribe, share, and thanks for watching. T2 out. PD, y'all be good.